In late December, we've now learned Pittsburgh City Council members quietly voted themselves a $16,000 pay raise. The city controller is calling that wrong. KDKA Money Editor John Delano has more on the controversial move. Remember the legislative pay grab of 2005 when state lawmakers boosted their pay in the middle of the night by 16% or 11,500 bucks? Turns out Pittsburgh City Council just voted themselves an even larger pay raise that the public didn't know a thing about. This was not in the original uh, budget proposal. Um, it was snuck basically into the budget uh, at the close of the budget uh, session this year or last year um, and uh, done without any public discussion, any public conversation. Pittsburgh City Controller Michael Lamb says a $16,000 or 22% pay raise was not in the original preliminary budget last September. That budget gave council members the same 3% increase other city workers got, a salary of $74,377. But by the time the final budget was voted in late December and signed by then Mayor Peduto, council salary had jumped to $88,000. This was done outside of the cameras, outside of the lights, with no one else in the room to, to, to question it, um, and it's just wrong. Council President Teresa Kale Smith defends the size of the raise and the process. The basic argument is that you did this secretly. Did you do yeah. this secretly? Well, I think that's that's a poor argument. That's a made-up argument. We did not do it secretively. There were public hearings. There was ample opportunity. We had a special vote um, where we put all the amendments in. But Lamb says none of the nine council members ever raised the 22% pay hike issue publicly during any hearings or discussion of amendments. So there was no way for the public to know about it and he hopes council reopens the budget on this issue. If they feel that they're so worthy of this increase uh, and they're proud to get behind it in a vote, uh, then they should be willing to do so in a public meeting. And that never happened. Council President Kale Smith tells me the budget is always open and council members are free to make whatever changes they wish.